Hello students, welcome to the fun known. Today we are going to learn operations of algebraic expression. Let us see factorization. We have seen factorization earlier. This really opposite of multiplying out or starting with the answer and working back to the brackets. Factorize as far as possible. 18p minus 30q. You can see Find the highest number if you are to factorization of this term 18p minus 30q. What we will do is find out the highest number which will divide all the terms that is HCF. You know there is LCM, similar way there is HCF that is finding out the highest term. So if you will see 18 and 30 also go into table, I think, yeah. Uh, no 30 doesn't go into right so yeah we are finding out the highest term over here i think both the values will be divided with 6 so 18p and 30q will be divided by 6 so here we can write it like this 6 and the bracket now we can see divide each term by number as you can see 18p divided by 6 the answer will be 3p now 30q divided by 6 the answer will be 5q so you can write it like this students 6 will be the common one 3p minus 5q now even though if you will try to simplify this value 6 into 3 that is 18p 6 into 5 that is 30q so this is how you can actually do factorization that is you can call it as revising or you can just coming reverse once again because till now we have seen we have been given this term or this expression and we were just converting this expression to this one now here in factorization we are doing opposite the output or this answer will be given to us that is this answer will be given to us and we have to find out the question now right so if this is given to us you have to make sure you have to find the highest number which is divided with them and that number you have to keep inside like outside the bracket and inside the bracket you have to make sure that you will put that numbers which will be helping out to get the answer so how you will be doing you have to make sure that that term will be divided by each of the terms and then whatever the answer will be you can put it over there Note, for dividing the terms containing power or indices, the power must be subtracted. You have to keep this in mind whenever you do factorization. Okay, students? Now, algebra factorization or fraction, addition and subtraction. Now, we'll see, students, how it actually works. Points to be noted while doing the fraction is there is a fraction with an example over here 2 divided by d that is d divided by 2 plus 2d divided by 3 d divided by 2 plus 2d divided by 3 find the lowest common denominator now you can see 2 and 3 if you will do the lcm of that lowest common denominator you will get the answer 6 so 6 is an lcm over here now next turn or next step for us is work out new top numerator how we are going to do that how you got 3d and 4d over there check it out students how you get that 3d and 4d yes you can actually see 6 and 6 this is just because of lcm now 6 you can see here you have just make sure that you have cross multiplied the values that is this 3 will be going here so it will be 3d and this 2 it will be going here so 22 it will be 4d so 3d divided by 6 plus 4d divided by 6 add or subtract the numerator example 2 let us see this is a second example for our students 4y divided by 5 3y divided by 4 minus 7y divided by 10 if these are the terms with us then what you will be doing is 5 4 and 10 you can find the lcm of these and after finding lcm of 5 4 and 10 you will get the answer as 20 you will be writing sign as it is you are not touching sign at all students 5 4 and 10 the lcm is 20 then 
what you will be doing here the variables are same as coefficient can be added means you have to add the same variable as coefficient that's why the numerator will become 16y plus 15y plus no minus 14y so after this and you are actually solving it because the denominator is same you can actually write 20 16y plus 15y minus 14y the answer will be 17y 20 i hope students you are getting how we are just making sure how this 20 comes 20 it will be an lcm you have to find the lcm of 5 4 and 10 after finding out, uh, finding out the lcm of 5 4 and 10 you will get the answer 20 and then you have to make sure that variables are same as coefficient so if the variable is same as coefficient we can add them and then we can just keep it as it is note if the answer contains letter look improper don't try to mix them out keep it as it is means if it is something of mixed fraction don't try to mix it out keep it as it is now here students sign with large numerator addition and subtraction see an example 2a plus 3 divided by 5 minus a minus 4 divided by 3 now how do you are going to do this the first thing what you are going to do you are going to write as it is the values then yes you can do the lcm of both the values that is 5 and 3 so you can write 15 will be the lcm of both the values after 15 you can multiply the whole value as this 3 will be whole multiplied with this and this 5 will be whole multiplied with this value that is 3 2 a plus 3 and 5 a minus 4 after doing that if you are solving that you can see 6 a plus 9 minus 5 a plus 20 divided by 15 again if you are simplifying that 6 a minus 5 a the answer will be a then 20 and 9 it will be 29 divided by 15 will be the answer now you can see multiplication and division this is what we have seen is addition and subtraction we are we are going to see multiplication and division now in multiplication and division 2y divided by 5y into 2 divided by 2w divide division y divided by 10 now let's see what is the example and how the solution is now we are just writing the value as it is what we have done students let's see here look look here here there was a division but now we are just reversing the value we are changing a numerator to denominator and denominator to numerator 10 was the denominator but here we are writing 10 as numerator and y was a numerator we are writing y as denominator so because we are just reversing both the values we can just put a multiplication sign over there so just because of that we can just write all multiplication and after writing all multiplication now you can cut the values 2y 5 see this 2 and this 2 will be considered uh, cancelled this 2 and this 2 will be cancelled this y and this y will be cancelled this 5 1s are and 5 2s are this will be cancelled you can see over here so answer will be 4 upon z w this will be the answer what we are going to give okay so 2 z w or 4 z w will be the answer because 2 and 2 will be the 4 1 and z and w will be the remaining part thank you for watching the video the fun note we'll see you in the next class students thank you